hi students in the last class we were discussing about properties of definite integral so now i would like to do some problems it's a one of the very important section so one question will be sure from this section so uh we will do the problems from the exercise first later on i uh, will do some problems from the solved examples also because that's very important it's very important section it's very important section so we are doing exercise 7.11 exercise 7.11 question number 1 integral 0 to pi by 2 cos square x dx so you know you can give cos square x is equal to that uh, uh, double angle formula use karke uska power reduce kar sakte hai so now i'm going to show you another method here you just call this as let i is equal to integral 0 to pi by 2 cos square x dx and aapke paas ek formula hai integral 0 to a e f of x dx which is equal to integral 0 to a e f of a minus x dx that means x ke jagah aap a minus x de sakte hai there is a property so i is equal to integral 0 to pi by 2 cos square x ke jagah aap pi by 2 minus x likh sakte hain it is same because this property says both are same if you write a minus x in place of x the value will not change so this is equals integral 0 to pi by 2 this you call this as 1 again i is equal to so 0 to pi by 2 aapko pata hai cos pi by 2 minus x cos pi by 2 minus x which is equal to sin x you know that so it is sin sin square x dx cos pi by 2 minus x is sin x so sin x square is sin square x dx you can call this as 2 add equation 1 and equation 2 i plus i 2i is equal to integral 0 to pi by 2 cos square x dx plus integral 0 to pi by 2 sin square x dx which is integral 0 to pi by 2 integral of a sum is a sum of the integrals so sum of the integrals you can combine this is cos square x plus sin square x dx that means aapko milega 2i is equal to integral 0 to pi by 2 1 dx so it's cos square x plus sin square x is 1 so integral 1 is x 0 to pi by 2 so that can be calculated by upper limit minus lower limit pahle upper limit then x is equal to pi by 2 pi by 2 minus 0 which is pi by 2 that implies i 2i is equal to pi by 2 that implies i is equal to pi by 4 that implies your i was 0 to pi by 2 cos square x dx that is equal to pi by 4 so you can calculate in different way cos square x ka power reducing identity use karke usko uh, uh, symbol uh, power with 1 degree karke usko integrate karke 0 to pi by 2 karke sab karenge to bhi you will get the same answer so this is one of the important property very very important property we are using this property very often 0 to f of x dx is equal to 0 to f of a minus x dx itna samajh lena x ke jagah aap 
k minus x substitute kar sakte then value will not change so that property is very very important one so we'll do one more question of that type you can see that okay integral 0 to pi by 2 uh, root sin x divided by root sin x plus root cos x dx so so we will call this as say let this is equal to i let i is equal to integral 0 to pi by 2 root sin x plus root sin x plus root cos x dx so call this is equation 1 again i is equal to integral 0 to pi by 2 under root sin x k jagah upper limit minus x pi by 2 minus x ab de sakte because you have the property integral 0 to a f of x dx it is same as integral 0 to a f of a minus x dx this property is there so x k jagah pi by 2 either a k jagah pi by 2 so pi by 2 minus x de sakte so again denominator mein sin pi by 2 minus x plus under root cos pi by 2 minus x dx which is integral 0 to pi by 2 under root sin pi by 2 minus x is cos x and divided by again root sin pi by 2 minus x is cos x plus cos pi by 2 minus x is sin x dx call this as 2 again add equation 1 and 2 i plus i left side is i so 2i is equal to integral you can see that denominator dono okay it is like under root sin x divided by 0 to pi by 2 under root sin x plus under root cos x dx plus integral 0 to pi by 2 under root cos x divided by under root cos x plus sin x dx so you can add those like uh, integral of a sum is a sum of the integrals so if you make it into one the numerator is same root sin x plus root cos x and upper root sin x plus root cos x aayega that cancel ho jayega aapko milega integral 0 to pi by 2 1 dx integral 1 is x that is 0 to pi by 2 so that you will get 2i is equal to upper limit pi by 2 minus 0 which is pi by 2 that implies aapko milega i is equal to pi by 4 and your i is nothing but here therefore you can conclude that this is equal to pi by 4 we say question number 3 and 4 you can do it in the same way question number 3 it is integral 0 to pi by 2 sin to the power 3 by 2 x divided by sin to the power 3 by 2 x plus cos to the power 3 by 2 x dx the same property i don't want to do it here again repeat it again here same property isko i call kar dena then pi by 2 x ke jagah pi by 2 minus x likh dena so aapko fir se wo uh, dono equation add karenge to 1 milega the same process it is same with the case question number 4 also integral 0 to pi by 2 cos to the power 5x divided by sin to the power 5x plus cos to the power 5x dx so it will be repetition so i don't want to repeat that again and again 
so that you can try yourself now another question using another property i want to discuss we will discuss every question i'm just taking property by property integral minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 integral minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 sin square x dx so whenever it comes here you may have to use this minus a to a f of x dx this you know that this is this has two values it is 2 into integral 0 to a f of x dx or 0 depending on f of x is even or f of x is odd so sabse pehle aapko check karna hai ki ye even hai kya odd hai kya so your function here f of x is equal to sin square x so even or odd I can check karne ke liye have to find f of minus x f of minus x matlab x ke jagah minus x de dena sin square matlab sin x ka square sin minus x is minus sin x uska square minus ka square plus a then sin x is sin square x sin x ka square sin square x so this is same as f of x that implies sin square x is an even function sin square x is an even function so now so therefore this you can write this is equal to this is 2 into integral 0 to pi by 2 sin square x dx now again this one 0 to pi by 2 sin square x dx you can separately find or you can use uh, this property like uh, this can be written as 2 into integral 0 to pi by 2 sin square x is 1 minus cos 2x by 2 dx which is equal to 2 into 1 by 2 constant that it is outside baki deko 1 integral is x minus cos 2x ka integral sin 2x divided by 2 0 to pi by 2 to ye wala to cancel ho jayega 2 1 by 2 abhi upper limit dena upper limit denge to x is equal to pi by 2 minus sin 2 into pi by 2 that is sin pi the whole divided by 2 that divided by 2 is the whole divided by 2 minus lower limit then 0 minus sin 0 divided by 2 uh, that divided by 2 is only for sin 0 so that is pi by 2 my sin pi is 0 so it is minus 0 so 0 by 2 0 minus 0 minus sin 0 is 0 0 by 2 0 so that means answer is pi by 2 so the answer is pi by 2 but either up chai to do strike my dad either ye wala up separate nikal sekte either usko i call kar dena so i is equal to integral 0 to pi by 2 sin square x dx so again that property apply kar sakte i is equal to isko 1 call kar dena so i is equal to 0 to pi by 2 sin square pi by 2 minus x so sin pi by 2 minus x is cos x so it is integral 0 to pi by 2 cos square x dx 1 and 2 add kar dena aapko milega 2i is equal to integral 0 to pi by 2 sin square x plus cos square that is 1 dx 
that means uh, it is x 0 to pi by 2 so upper limit pi by 2 minus 0 so that means i is equal to pi by 4 so i ka value mila so then either substitute kar dena then that is this is equals 2 into uska value mila hai pi by 4 so 2 into pi by 4 which is equal to pi by 2 like that also you can find the answer it is up to you another question integral minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 sine to the power 7x dx so again minus a to a so either aapka function f of x f of x is equal to sine to the power 7x so f of minus x that means sine x ke jaga minus x de dena to the power 7 that is sin minus x is minus sin x to the power 7 minus 7 times multiply karenge to minus sin x to the power 7 madlab sin 7x sin to the power 7x which is minus of f of x that means sin to the power 7x is an odd function so it is an odd function so therefore this value is equal to zero another question of the same type integral minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 x cube plus x cos x plus tan to the power 5x plus 1 dx so integral of a sum is a sum of their integrals so you can write this as it is my integral minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 x cube dx plus minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 x cos x dx plus integral minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 tan to the power 5x plus integral minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 1 dx now here if you see x cube f of x is equal to x cube so f of minus x is minus x the whole cube which is minus x cube that is minus of original function so x cube is odd function odd function to value zero ho jayega then next is f of x is equal to x cos x f of minus x is equal to minus x into cos minus x minus x into cos minus x is same as cos x that is minus of f of x that means x cos x is also odd function then tan to the power 5x that is your f of x in the third function f of minus x is tan minus x to the power 5 tan minus x is minus tan x to the power 5 minus multiplied 5 times minus then tan x to the power 5x so that is minus of f of x that implies tan to the power 5x is odd so this will become it is like this the first value is 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus integral 1 is x minus pi by 2 to pi by 2 so which is upper limit there than a pi by 2 minus lower limit there than a minus pi by 2 so pi by 2 plus pi by 2 which is 2 pi by 2 that is answer is pi see another question integral 0 to pi by 2 0 to pi by 2 log 
फोर प्लस थ्री साइन एक्स डिवाइडेड बाय फोर प्लस थ्री कॉस एक्स डी एक्स तो देखेंगे तो बहुत कॉम्प्लिकेट लगेगा सो बट सिंपली लेट दिस फंक्शन इज इक्वल टू आई अगेन हमारे पास जो प्रॉपर्टी था x के जगह m माइनस एक्स दे सकते सो दिस इज सेम आस आई इज इक्वल टू इंटीग्रल सीरो टू पाई बाई टू लॉग फोर प्लस थ्री साइन x के जगह पाई बाई टू माइनस एक्स वैल्यू विल नॉट चेंज फोर प्लस थ्री कॉस एक्स के जगह पाई बाई टू माइनस एक्स दैट प्रॉपर्टी डी एक्स द प्रॉपर्टी आस यू नो इट इज इंटीग्रल सीरो टू ए एफ ऑफ एक्स डी एक्स इज इक्वल टू इंटीग्रल सीरो टू ए एक्स के जगह ए माइनस एक्स दे सकते हैं सो नाउ दिस इज इक्वल्स इंटीग्रल जीरो टू पाई बाई टू लॉग फोर प्लस थ्री साइन पाई बाई टू माइनस एक्स इज कॉस एक्स डिवाइडेड बाय फोर प्लस थ्री कॉस पाई बाई टू माइनस एक्स इज साइन एक्स डी एक्स सो दिस इज योर वन This is two. One plus two करेंगे तो आपको मिलेगा two i is equal to integral zero to pi by two. It is like this log four plus three sin x divided by four plus three cos x plus log Four plus three cos x divided by four plus three sin x dx. That means two i equals integral zero to pi by two log e a plus log b is log a into b. So log four plus three sin x divided by Four plus three cos x into four plus three cos x divided by four plus three sin x dx. So that is integral zero to pi by two. It is log one. Log one is zero. Integral zero to pi by two zero, which is equal to Zero. Right. So that means two i is equal to zero. That implies i is equal to zero. So the value is zero. Now I will discuss another type of question. The same thing. Properties of definite integral, but another property. Integral minus five to five modulus of x plus two dx. So here, I'm. I mean, I said like, if our minus five minus a two a, so even or odd function का property है. ऐसे नहीं. So इधर तो mod x plus two. तो हम अभी उधर even or odd नहीं बोल सकते. So उसको हम कर रहे. सबसे पहले ये modulus को निकालना है. मॉड एक्स का डेफिनेशन आपको पता है मॉड एक्स इज इक्वल टू दो वैल्यूज है एक्स इट सेल्फ इफ एक्स इज ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो माइनस ऑफ एक्स इफ एक्स इज लेस देन जीरो सो मॉडलस ऑफ एक्स प्लस टू इज इक्वल टू एक्स प्लस टू इट सेल्फ If x plus two is greater than or equal to zero, that means x is greater than or equal to minus two. It is minus of x plus two when x plus two is less than zero. That means x is less than minus two. So, हम क्या कर सकते हैं? हम इसको split कर सकते हैं. We can split this. This can be written as integral. माइनस फाइव टू 
माइनस टू एंड माइनस फाइव से माइनस टू तक मॉडल ऑफ एक्स प्लस टू इज एक्स प्लस टू इट सेल्फ सॉरी मॉडल ऑफ एक्स प्लस टू इज माइनस हो क्योंकि माइनस टू से लेस से तो इट इज माइनस ऑफ एक्स प्लस टू डी एक्स प्लस माइनस टू टू फाइव That means when x is greater than minus two, x plus two modulus of x plus two ka value, x plus two itself. Like that we can divide. So the property we are using is integral a to b f of x dx. It can be written as integral a to c f of x dx plus integral c to b f of x dx. तो हमने वो बीच में जो नंबर मिलने के लिए x प्लस टू मॉडलस ऑफ x प्लस टू मॉडलस रख करके हम प्रॉब्लम नहीं कर सकते हैं इसलिए हमने मॉडलस को निकाल दिया मॉडलस को उसका डेफिनेशन यूज करके निकाल दिया मॉडलस ऑफ x प्लस टू इज x प्लस टू इट सेल्फ वेन एवर एक्स प्लस टू इज ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू जीरो दैट मीन्स x इज ग्रेटर दैन और इक्वल टू माइनस टू इट इज इक्वल टू माइनस ऑफ x प्लस टू वेन एक्स इज लेस दैन माइनस टू इसलिए वो स्प्लिट कर दिया नौ now you can simplify this like integrate you can if you want you can take this minus outside no issue uh this is equals you just take that minus outside or you can just uh, flip the lower limit and upper limit to avoid the minus sign it's up to you so anyway i took the minus outside now x plus 2 integral x ka integral x square by 2 plus integral 2 is 2x minus 5 to minus 2 plus again x ka integral x square by 2 plus 2 ka integral 2x then it is minus 2 to 5 now this is equals minus is there outside देन पहले अपर लिमिट दे देना माइनस टू दे दो माइनस टू का स्क्वायर फोर फोर बाय टू टू माइनस टू का स्क्वायर फोर फोर बाय टू टू प्लस टू इन टू माइनस टू दैट इज माइनस फोर अपर लिमिट दे दिया माइनस अभी लोअर लिमिट दे देना माइनस फाइव का स्क्वायर ट्वेंटी फाइव सो ट्वेंटी फाइव डिवाइडेड बाई टू प्लस टू इन टू माइनस फाइव दैट इज माइनस टेन प्लस देखिए नेक्स्ट में पहले अपर लिमिट दे देना फाइव सो फाइव स्कोर ट्वेंटी फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव बाई टू प्लस टेन माइनस माइनस टू दे दे लोअर लिमिट माइनस टू का स्क्वायर फोर फोर बाई टू 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 माइनस टू इंटू माइनस टू फोर आप इसको It's up to you now. The simplification you can simplify like uh, two minus four. So any it is up to your logic. You can simplify this separately. Two minus four, then minus twenty-five by two minus ten. Can I say we have simplified? Right? Means it, you have to simplify this. That's all. This equals. So they go two minus four. Two minus four is minus two. There is a minus outside, so it becomes two minus minus. Plus, so twenty five by two minus ten a bracket ke under plus twenty five by two plus ten then minus two minus four is minus two so minus minus two plus two. सो आप देखेंगे तो इधर एक माइनस टेन प्लस टेन कैंसिल हो जाएगा सो टू प्लस टू फोर बाकी है ट्वेंटी फाइव बाई टू प्लस ट्वेंटी फाइव बाई टू दैट इज फिफ्टी बाई टू दैट इज ट्वेंटी फाइव सो ट्वेंटी फाइव प्लस फोर विच इज इक्वल टू फिफ्टी फोर प्लस फिफ्टी बाई टू इज ट्वेंटी फाइव विच इज Twenty nine. So the value is twenty nine. 
one more question of this type integral 2 to 8 x minus 5 modulus of x minus 5 dx तो इधर सबसे पहले आपको मॉडलस ऑफ x माइनस फाइव विच इज इक्वल x माइनस फाइव इट सेल्फ इफ x माइनस फाइव इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू जीरो दैट मीन्स x इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू फाइव इट इज इक्वल माइनस ऑफ x माइनस फाइव इफ x इज लेस देन फाइव सो यू कैन स्प्लिट दिस दिस इज इक्वल्स integral 2 to 5 when le less than 5 it is minus of x minus 5 dx plus integral 5 to 8 when x is more than 8 bit or between 5 and 8 it is uh, when x is more than 5 x minus 5 modulus of x minus 5 is x minus 5 itself dx the rest you can do because it's the same as the last case so you have to do i will just tell you the answer the answer will be 9 you have to complete this all the solved exercise solved examples in the textbook is very 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 important especially in this properties of definite integral there is one question minus 1 to the minus 1 to 2 3 by 2 integral minus 1 to 3 by 2 modulus of x sin pi x dx to sabse pehle modulus nikal dena hame modulus nikalna hai to ये हमें पता होना चाहिए कि वेयर इट इज लेस देन जीरो और वेयर इट इज ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू जीरो उसके लिए सबसे पहले हमें एक्स साइन पाई एक्स वेयर जीरो होते वो हमें चेक करना तो so, ये सीरो होते x इज इक्वल टू जीरो और साइन पाई एक्स इज इक्वल टू जीरो एक्स इज इक्वल टू जीरो और साइन पाई एक्स इज इक्वल टू जीरो सो साइन सो साइन थीटा साइन एक्स इज इक्वल टू जीरो मतलब हमें पता है एक्स इज मल्टीपल ऑफ पाई एवरी मल्टीपल ऑफ पाई एन बिलोंग्स टू इट एवरी मल्टीपल ऑफ पाई जीरो दैट मीन्स पाई एक्स इज इक्वल टू मल्टीपल ऑफ पाई सो दैट मीन्स एक्स इज इक्वल टू एन एन इज इंडिजल दैट मीन्स एक्स का वैल्यू हो सकते है जैसे माइनस थ्री माइनस टू माइनस वन जीरो वन टू एक्सेट्रा पर इधर हमें सिर्फ चाहिए देखो माइनस वन से लेके माइनस वन से लेके थ्री बाई टू तक हमें चाहिए सो माइनस वन एंड थ्री बाई टू के बीच में जीरो है वन है थ्री बाई टू वन पॉइंट फाइव बाद में टू उसे राइट साइड में आ रहे नहीं चाहिए अभी सो दैट यू कैन सी दैट दैट थ्री फोर पॉइंट्स डिवाइड्स इनटू थ्री पार्ट्स द नंबर लाइक अभी इधर साइन पाई एक्स एक्स इनटू साइन पाई एक्स एक्स इनटू साइन पाई एक्स ये पॉजिटिव है क्या नेगेटिव चेक करना सो so, जीरो और माइनस वन के बीच में एक टेस्टिंग पॉइंट ले लो माइनस वन बाई थ्री सो यू कैन सी दैट एक्स दैट इज माइनस वन बाई थ्री 
into sine minus pi by 3 that is minus 1 by 3 into sine minus theta is minus sine so sine pi by 3 so minus into minus a ho jayega plus abhi 0 and 1 ke beech mein you can take any value take uh, One by three. So they go one by three into sine pi by three. One by three positive, sine pi by three positive. So it's positive or jayega again positive. And one and three by two, one and three by two ke beech mein. You can take any value. Or they go. So x is anyway, either x is the positive, x to positive. Then one denge to kya milega sine pi. Three by two to sine three pi by two. So that means sine pi to sine three pi by two. That means it is actually third quadrant now. Third quadrant. That means up one they then get to actually do sine pi. Three by two then get to sine three pi by two. That means sine pi se leke sine three pi by two. Un ke do beech mein value. So it is actually third quadrant. Third quadrant sine is always negative. So that means udar it is plus into minus negative aayega. So ab ye conclude kar sakte hai ki you can conclude this. So you can conclude like this modulus of x into sine pi x. This is equal x sine pi x itself where x is between minus 1 and 1. Okay, minus 1 and you can see that minus 1 say like 1 the kuska value positive. So whenever x is positive mod x is x itself. So x sine pi x is positive from minus 1 to 1. So its value is that value itself. 1 say 3 by 2 the you can see that x sine pi x is negative. So you can say it is negative of x sine pi x when x is between 1 and 3 by 2. So this can be written as this can be written as integral minus 1 to 1 minus 1 to 1 it is x sine pi x dx plus 1 to 3 by 2 minus x sine pi x dx. I say up split kar sakte hai. So now you have to integrate so this much it's uh, remaining for back integration up curse like the you can apply integration by parts here first into integration by parts apply cardano I will just tell you here we'll do it here x sine pi x so this is your first function this is your second function integral first into so x into integral of second integral of sine pi integral sine x is minus cos x so minus cos pi x but x square jagger pi da so pi se divide kar first into integral of second 
minus integral of derivative of first derivative x is 1 into integral of second integral sin x is minus cos pi x by pi dx so it is nothing but it is minus x cos pi x divided by pi that minus minus becomes plus integral cos x is sin x so it is sin pi x divided by pi square already one pi constant the so sin pi x by pi square okay so that is integral so oh, integration by parts apply karna integration by parts apply karna hai. so here we have to apply integration by parts so maine wo right side mein separate karke dikhaya so that value i am going to write there so minus x cos pi x cos pi x by pi plus sin pi x divided by pi square then minus 1 to 1 then you can see that here there is a minus sign so minus outside aayega so minus baki x sin pi x integral is the same thing only minus x cos pi x divided by pi plus sin pi x divided by pi square 1 to 3 by 2 अभी आपको अपर लिमिट माइनस लोअर लिमिट देना है सो so वन दे दो जब वन देगा आप देखेंगे तो कॉस वन देंगे तो एक्स को वन देंगे तो कॉस पाई कॉस पाई इज माइनस वन cos pi is equal to cos pi is equal to minus 1 then x ko 1 de re so minus 1 into 1 that is minus 1 minus 1 divided by pi so minus 1 divided by pi plus idhar 1 de denge to sin pi sin pi is 0 0 by anything 0 so minus 1 by pi so upper limit de diya minus lower limit dena hai sab so, jab lower limit dega minus 1 dena hai cos minus pi so cos minus pi is also same as minus 1 then minus minus 1 so plus 1 so again pi in c minus 1 de diya pi into minus 1 that is cos minus pi the value is 1 i will repeat here jab ab x ko 1 dege upper limit denge to pi into 1 cos pi aayega cos pi ka value minus 1 इधर एक्स दे दें वन दे देंगे तो माइनस वन सो माइनस वन इंटू माइनस वन दैट विल बिकम प्लस वन सो इट इज वन बाई पाई देन इधर साइन पाई एक्स साइन पाई जीरो है जीरो बाई समिंग जीरो देन अभी लोअर लिमिट दे रहे माइनस वन दे रहे सो माइनस वन दे देंगे तो कॉस पाई इंटू माइनस वन यू कैन डू इट सेपरेटली आई एम डूइंग इट इन वन स्टेप पाई इंटू माइनस वन माइनस पाई कॉस माइनस पाई इज माइनस वन अगेन माइनस ऑफ माइनस वन वन एक्स को वन दे रहे एक्स को माइनस वन दे रहे सो माइनस माइनस वन 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 इंटू माइनस वन माइनस वन माइनस वन बाई पाई 
minus one by pi. Then lower limit either minus one there is the pi into minus one sine minus pi sine any multiple of pi is zero so zero by anything zero ही हो जाएगा. So आपको first में apply करेंगे तो ऐसे मिल रहे one by pi minus minus one by pi. Here again अभी upper limit दे रहे three by two. जब थ्री बाई टू देगा थ्री बाई टू देगा कॉस पाई इंटू थ्री बाई टू कॉस थ्री बाई बाई टू जीरो आएगा सो जीरो बाई एनी थिंग जीरो ही आएगा सो उसके बारे में ज्यादा सोचना नहीं जीरो देन साइन थ्री पाई बाई टू साइन थ्री पाई बाई टू इज माइनस वन सो माइनस वन बाई पाई स्क्वायर देन लोअर लिमिट दे माइनस लोअर लिमिट देना x is equal to one there. One देंगे तो cos pi into one cos pi. Cos pi is minus one. Then minus into x is equal to one. So minus one minus one into minus one 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 by pi. So it is one by pi. Then इधर substitute करेंगे तो sine pi into one. That is sine pi sine pi is zero. So zero हो जाएगा. So you will get like this. So we put upper limit minus lower limit. पहले one दे दिया, then इधर minus one दे दिया, upper limit minus. So again say minus. Again here also upper limit minus lower limit. So this will become left side I'll with the green ink. One by pi minus minus one by pi. That is two by pi. Minus one into minus of minus one, so minus minus plus one by pi square minus minus pi plus one by pi. So one by plus one by one by pi plus one by pi that is three by pi plus one by pi square. That's the answer.